Hey everybody, Selena here in Rainia's Kitchen with Rainia. And I know we've been doing a lot of delicious street food recipes. We are. So doing what's today? A month of them. New Orleans shrimp po' boy. Mmm. You want to know how to sandwich. blacken shrimp? Yes. Five tablespoons of unsalted butter. And I have here about, oh, I'm gonna say a really good, generous, or more. It's okay to add more of a Creole seasoning. Okay, and I'll I have to go buy to that. The, you have to buy that. You can make it, but it's a bit of a pain. And mm -hmm. they sell Creole seasoning everywhere, so just buy it. Now, can you smell that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So I you have this on it. high, okay? Very important. Mm -hmm. I'm going to take one pound of shrimp that has been um, deveined. Obviously, the shell's off, tail's off, and it's deveined. And the shrimp doesn't take long. Yeah. And once the shrimp is cooked, I'm going to add some garlic in here, okay? And that, you won't need salt or pepper because of the Creole seasoning. Yeah. Okay, now, you already put the remoulade sauce, which I had to make ahead, it's in a great. bowl. It's great, I already tasted that's it. That's going to be our dressing. Okay. Okay, and if you can, without, with what? Oh, oh, I was oh. just gonna say, if you can do this without breaking the back, <laughs> I want you to spoon a generous amount on each side. I can do it. But I don't want you I'll to be... break the back, otherwise okay. it's going to be hard to eat. Okay. Now, this also takes a coleslaw, so I have here a generous, really generous teaspoon or more of Dijon mustard. Is this enough or more? Well, uh, you want to really hit the, oh. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sugar, a little bit of cider vinegar, Little bit of, you can do vegetable oil, canola oil, whatever you want. Some salt. Mm-hmm. Some pepper. And I did, I bought the packaged coleslaw that's already shredded. Mm -hmm. And it's the red cabbage, the green cabbage. But I added some shredded carrots and onions to my mix. Ah. Now mix, 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 mix. Once they start to firm up and turn pink, they're done. And since they're almost done, but not quite, let's add that garlic in. Okay. I'm, I just put it to the garlic press. Okay, now, Selena, you have another job. As gently as possible, mm -hmm. try to just get this mixed. Okay. All right, you do that while I watch the shrimp. I mean, does this not smell fabulous? It smells so, so good. So fabulous. These, oh. I love blackened shrimp. You can do a fried shrimp po boy, mm -hmm. but frankly, I like blackened shrimp because I think that's a little more authentic, in my opinion. My shrimp is done, and I must say, you're a very aggressive remoulade saucer. I love the sauce. Yeah, yeah, well, I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is easier. I'm already good to prepare yeah, oh for my, my bites. Yeah, put your hair back. Oh my gosh, Selena. Wow. Uh, oh wow. I dare you. And there's some napkins. I will gladly take on that dare. Right. Here we go, Rainya. Go for it, kid. Oh. <laughs> Messy, but good. Street food. So good. So mm. darn good. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That's the mess. Yes. Oh yeah. That's how you know it's good when you uh, have it all over your face I love like that. Selena just dives in. She yeah. Shy. She's it's not so afraid. Good. Yeah. For a copy of today's recipes, go to PittsburghTodayLive.com and we will have it posted for you there.